This game is rated M and is intended for mature audiences. Don't let your kids watch it! Hey there, Artie! <laughs> KG, we lost the art business because you went off to play baseball with a golf club and eat desserts. <laughs> I didn't eat the desserts yet. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. Love you. Today was the day of the barbecue party that was the Hinamizawa Fighters victory celebration. Oh, great! More coach! Of course, I, having prepared myself, skipped breakfast in order to stay hungry. <laughs> Good man. <laughs> Though, with all the club members coming, it was pretty possible there would be a contest based on how fast or how much you could eat. Rena was already at our usual meeting place. Mion arrived a few minutes later. <laughs> Did we all skip breakfast? Oh, <laughs> Rena, if skipping breakfast is unhealthy, then I'm the unhealthiest person who ever lived. Why? Do they have white horses in Japan? I don't know.絶対来ないと思う。We've <laughs> 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 had one, yes, but what about second breakfast? Yeah, I could see Rena doing that. Wait, who did this gluttonous princess think was going to come for her? Yeah. The venue for said barbecue was to be the Furude Shrine grounds where Rikachan lived. Okay, that'll be nice. But Coach is going to be there, which is not nice. They held events and festivals there, and barbecues too. It was the place that held all sorts of ceremonies in Hinamizawa. Come to think of it, there was supposed to be a big village festival coming up, wasn't there? Watanagashi or something. Oh yeah, nothing bad's gonna happen then. The scenery you could see from high up was fairly superb, and the calm atmosphere, in particular to shrines, was something fairly difficult to find in the city. We left our bicycles at the bottom of the shrine steps and broke into a mad dash up the stairs. When we arrived at the shrine grounds, the Hinamizawa fighters and their fathers had already gathered and begun setting up for the barbecue early. Oh, the dads are there too! Of course, the Toko and Rika-chan were there as well. When they noticed our arrival, they waved to us. Yeah. まさか霜降りが一口でも食べられるなんて思ってるんじゃないだろうな。以前ここで弁当を送った時を思い出せ。俺と佐藤の致命的なリーチさで今回も圧倒してやるぜ。So that happened in chapter one. So it also happened here too. な、なんですって。そ、そんなの絶対に許せませんわ。泣こうが雨こうが。佐藤は目の前で牛肉を頬張ると見るだけだ。ピーマンやナスは譲ってやるからな。ヘイ、アニズグレイ。僕も佐藤にカボチャを焼いたのをいっぱい。This サトコはカボチャが大好きだって。監督のことだから日本全国からたくさんのカボチャを山盛り集めてきてくれるね。よかったな、サトコ。どのカボチャも寄り取り緑だぞ。朝から晩までずっと3食カボチャ三枚だ
So, just before Satoko hit Rena, I grabbed her by the nape of her neck and pulled her back. A superb reaction with only seconds of foresight. At least it was supposed to be. But for Rena, when I caught the leaping crying Satoko, it looked like I was keeping her to myself. <laughs> what crocodile tears? <laughs> I wouldn't beat up Mion. She has a gun. <laughs> she can fight back. <laughs> uh oh, that doesn't look good. Your mouth didn't open nearly wide enough for a scream like that. Ba bam! What did Rika do? Rika didn't participate in that. I can't wait for Rana to become a professional mercenary after high school. Yeah, I agree. There was absolutely no call for that. Rika's innocent. Satoko laughed in a shrill voice at Rika-chan and Rena's unproductive game of tag while we watched them sprawled out on the ground. No! Not him! Go back to growing the meat! I don't want to talk to you! The coach came over and lent us a hand. No! I don't like that. We communicate through violence and sexual innuendos. I don't want to be part of that club. Also, wow, Mion had a miraculous recovery from being in a full body cast yesterday. <laughs> she was just faking those injuries. <laughs> Based. You never learn, do you? Laughed the coach loudly. It made us start to laugh, too. Ah, coach is funny. <laughs> Satoko's laughter at Rika-chan's yelling and Rena's strange voice were kind of comfortable to hear. <laughs> Rena talks weird, did you notice? <laughs> oh, stupid Higarashi. <laughs> the adults here knew what they were doing, so the barbecue was ready in short order. As the salad oil dripped down onto the plate with a hiss, there was a loud cheer. When the coach brought over a big plate with all the meat on it, we all cheered again. Is this actual barbecue, or is this just grilling it? Grilling is not barbecue. She took it with the big brain strats yesterday. I still don't know how she pulled it off. そうだね。今日の主品はサトコちゃんに違いないね。確かに最後のホームランを打ったのは真逆もなくサトコだもんな。しかも油断させたとはいえ、小細工なしの特大アーチ。サトコは運動神経は良いのです。いや、I Satoko, for whom the excessive praise made her not notice the moderately grilled meat being stolen one after the other, was just far too cute. Oh, that's gotta be the brisket. Yes. Tomita Kun and Okamura Kun were carrying something over to us. It was a huge barbecue plate. Oh, yeah! <laughs> if that's not brisket, it's not the protagonist. The plate was chock full of skewers with vegetables and meat on them. The grilled, burning hot meat juices made a shh noise as they drizzle off. You need a lot of heat for cooking something on a metal skewer, so they had grilled the whole plate at once. Yeah, 
早く持っていこうよいしょよいしょわあ、見て見てすごいのが来たよバーバーキュー、everyone greeted us with a cheer Each person received a skewer of vegetables and big pieces of meat on it. So they're just kebabs. They also received paper cups filled to the brim with juice. In my right hand were pounds of piping hot barbecue. In the left was a cup of juice that I could chug down. If this didn't make you want to dance, you weren't a man. Barbecue is fantastic. Oh, <laughs> Keiji, we've got to say grace first, obviously. I'd rather not. The coach with a cup of beer in his hand mounted the nearby beer cooler. This was supposed to be a victory celebration, after all. We needed an opening statement. Damn, I hope it ends soon. For every second this goes on, a little more of the food's freshness goes away. Duh! Sotoko stomped down onto the back of my foot. いい年の男が癒しいですわねもう少しエレガントに我慢できませんの俺ってつくづく思ってることが顔に出ちゃうのな<笑>ケイチ、you're drooling <笑>じゃあ、みんないいですか昨日は大勝利でしたね It was a grudge match. すごいピッチャーの登場で苦戦もしましたがこちらも同じくらい頼もしいスケットの登場で見事逆転勝利を収めることができましたクラップクラップクラップ。Both my hands were full, so the other adults and older brothers gave a round of applause to us. 今日はその戦勝祝賀会です。約束通り、美味しいお肉をいっぱい用意しましたからね。今日はいっぱい食べて、次の試合への活力にしていきましょう。Oh yeah, then after a few words of thanks to the fathers and brothers who helped with the barbecue, he led us in a toast. They say that when you're toasting, you would normally down the contents of your cup. But we were young. At the toast, all of us immediately began to dig into our skewers. Heck yes. After that, it got really lively, with everyone congratulating one another for the things they did during the game. Like how someone made a great catch, or how, some, uh, how awesome someone looked <laughs> when stealing a base. Of course, they congratulated me too, the savior who appeared to fight against the Koshian pitcher. <laughs> あれは佐藤子の活躍だったわけだから。<笑> Did you know we cheated? <笑>確かに佐藤子の作戦ではあったけどさ。I don't know how Satoko found out about the pitcher's dessert fetish, but like I guess it came in clutch. カメラを口説き落とすなんて真似はケイちゃん以外にはできなかったわけだし。十分ケイちゃんも称えられるに値する活躍をしてるよ。そういえばケイチ子。あの後カメダ君と一緒にケーキを食べに行ったんだよね。Wait, we did that the same day? <laughs> well, I mean, thank God we don't actually have to have a scene of that. なんだかすっごく仲良さそうだった。<laughs> I mean, ライバル関係から男同士の友情が芽生えちゃったわけ<laughs> ?I like to say we just both like to eat cookies. そういうのってなんだかその。I violently brushed through Rena's hair as she turned red in the face for some reason at the mention of friendship between males, dispersing her pleasant seeming ideas. Now then, where's the hero, or rather the heroine, Satoko? Oh, there she is. Satoko was a freak of John in the middle of bragging her heart about how to look at home run yesterday. And her teammates spared no compliment for her, since even though he was going easy on her, the fact that she hit a throw from a Koshian pitcher was something else. Satoko was more loquacious than usual, and it seemed like she was in a good mood. She was flying so high that I thought for a moment about getting a word in to tease her. But she was the leading actress today, so I decided not to bully her at all. As I watched Satoko going at Fane's as lively as usual under the sun, it struck me that it didn't quite line up with the pleasant time I'd spent with her. But both of those were the real Satoko. I didn't care who it was, her smiling happily or making a big lively fuss like this. Just as long as she would keep us smiling like this forever. The coach had approached me from behind before I realized it. As he gazed at Satoko from afar, like I had been doing, he addressed me. So I could tell he was talking about her. Satoko-chan no ega o m i t e r to, nanda ka kokoro ga araware ru kiga s h i m a s e n I don't like where this is going. He smiled, refreshed, searching for confirmation. I felt a little embarrassed to admit it, so against my better judgment, I played it off. So, so this guy? I t s no ego, Jack. Sarah, it's my look near a night to moon this kid on a. All right. 
<笑>それを聞いたらパトコちゃん怒るんでしょうねでもそんな彼女もとってもキュートなんですよ Leaving her cuteness aside, I could understand him thinking Satoko getting angry and for being teased would be funny. えっと、イリアさんでしたっけイリエです。イリエでも、みんな監督って呼びますからね。前原さんも監督と呼んでくださると。<笑> I would love it if you joined the baseball team and called me coach. As he said that, coach Yuri smiled, blushing a little. 監督は、サトコのことを気に入ってるみたいです、ね。<笑> coach? This seems a little creepy. <笑> I didn't have any real basis for saying that. It was just what I felt to be true. Eh, he needs to be a little bit of 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 a I'd heard that this coach guy was the kind of person who said crazy things out of nowhere. According to Mion, if I took everything he said seriously, I physically wouldn't be able to take it. If I was able to ignore that part of him, he seemed like he'd be a really funny guy. Okay, there are, I'm just gonna say, there's some things you probably shouldn't be joking about. Especially to somebody who you don't actually know and they don't know if everything you say is a joke or not. Are? Now, Maibara san, did Yes! If that doesn't surprise somebody, You have. Well, no. Well, he clearly already has multiple problems. That is not what I was shocked about! How old is this guy? He is at least older than who we are. He is no question. Young, he's no way younger than 18. He looks like he's an adult. He looks like he could easily be my age. You should not. Again, can we please punch this guy? She's. You, how? She's only 12. Gantok, Nanjunem Momania. Yeah. Mada Satoka, Marte Naito Moon Disket. What the freaking weirdo? Hm? Why are you laughing about it? Okay, he's the main villain, no question. Coach gave a dry grin and laughed. Was this how I should be doing it? I must somehow master the art of responding to this coach guy. After that, I received many words of praise for my actions, almost too many. As that conversation was happening, leaving aside the controversial statements this coach person would spout suddenly, I learned he was very composed and not a bad guy by any stretch. Uh huh! I don't know about that! <laughs> that's, that's funny, Keiji. I think coach should be on some kind of a list. サトコちゃんのお兄さんはどちらかというとおとなしい文系のタイプでしたきっとサトコちゃんはその反対の才能に恵まれたんでしょうご存知ないですかサトコちゃんのお兄さんです北条サトシ君と言いましてね彼も Oh, that's funny. He had the baseball bat. Oh, yes, he transferred. So he transferred. Yeah, maybe that was a little more considerate than saying he ran away. Now that he mentioned it, I think it was Rena. I think she said Satoshi transferred too. That was back in Act 1, or in Chapter 1. I didn't know the details about him having run away from home at the time, so I didn't pay much attention to it, but. Everyone having fun was far away, and their cheerful voices distant. The chorus of cicadas separated us from them, giving me a sense of distance. At first, I thought my own voice was too soft for even me to hear. But for a really long time, Coach didn't respond to my words. So at this point, I began to wonder if, he had, if I had said something I shouldn't have. Just when I began to feel impatient, Coach finally spoke. After informing me that he, what was about to say he was a secret, Coach began to talk a little at a time. Backstory? Satoko-chan's 
事故に遭われましてね。Oh, yeah. 事故。ええ。旅先の公園で展望台から転落されましてね。Or like they thought they might have been involved. It was supposed to be just a little time away from the house with the family. They went on a walk on a path through a nature field after it had rained. There was a little viewing platform that looked like it had a good view. That was the stage on which the tragedy was set. The metal fixtures in the viewing platform fence had deteriorated from time. And with all the rain they had just gotten, they might have loosened somewhat. Right before Satoko's eyes, both the fence and her parents fell. There was a river some tens of meters below. The water level was high due to the rain, and apparently very muddy. So, the. Liu x i n Coach gave a thin but melancholic smile and touched his paper cup to his lips. Without saying anything, I knew how unfortunate that accident was, and how Satoko's parents had left on an eternal vacation. Yeesh! And she saw that? Yeesh! Ja, Satoko te. She saw that when she was like eight or nine. I was so focused on being careful of my words that I lost what I was going to say. A single word. Orphaned. I knew how little consideration it showed and how much it would hurt Satoko without having to say it out loud. Come to think of it, Satoko lived with Rika chan. At least that's what I thought I heard from the others. Wait, Rika chan? Her father died from illness too, and her mother soon after. I felt like I heard she was living by herself. Hey. 今はフルデさんと一緒に生活しています二人ともご両親がいなくて心細い日もあったでしょうが助け合いながら生活しているようです<笑>親の庇護なく生きていくっていうのはあの年頃にはとても辛いことだと思います。Yeah. 前原さんでもその辺はわかるでしょ、mm-hmm. so、フルデさんは特に村のお年寄りに慕われていますからね。この村にいる限り生きていくのにそんなに不自由はないでしょう。そういえばそうですね。リカちゃんって村のマスコットみたいなところがありますからね。確かにこの村での生活には困らないように思います。リカちゃんが、ミープ、ジュース、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、ウォンス、We learned in chapter two she was like the last of the one of the three great clans. So she actually kind of has a lot of power. Rika being so spoiled was just an exception. Upon thinking about it normally, living on your own as a child should be fraught with difficulty. It wasn't then very difficult to imagine how much suffering Satoko had to go through just to live. It wasn't very difficult to imagine. How did they have money? Rika must be ju- using her trust fund or something. Was I really thinking that? No, I was only thinking the words. I couldn't imagine it in the slightest. How was I supposed to imagine it when I saw that annoying smile of hers? There was no way I could. I found out she was living apart from her brother, and I just kind of vaguely thought that it was rather unfortunate. I mean, Satoko was smiling so energetically every single day. Was I thinking that her smiling meant that she wasn't hurt? That she didn't feel lonely? When she found out my parents were coming home the other night, Satoko said, A family sitting around the dinner table is the most fun way to enjoy a meal at all. Those words held a lot more weight now. If it were someone other than you, I would think that's very sweet of you. Eh? It's a secret. After warning me, Coach put his index finger to his lips. I was in this year, I was a How do you have a good reputation with all the crap you say? Yeah, that's. Yep, that, that, that's. 
<笑>残念ですさとこちゃんにパパって呼んでもらえる計画は早くもとんざですか This guy spots some crazy stuff. At first, I was only half listening. But midway through, I realized how rude that was. This coach person seriously only wished for this one girl, Satoko, to be happy. That was neither crazy nor was it nonsense. He just wanted her to be happy. Those were his true feelings. Satoko ちゃんの今の生活は決して幸福なものではないでしょう。でもね、それをほんの少しでも和らげてあげたいと思ってるんです。<笑>もっとも余り物のお裾分けや力仕事のお手伝いくらいしかしてあげられませんがね。幸せですよ、サトコ。はコーチショーのサプライズは、こんなにもサトコの幸せを強く願う人間がこんなに身近にいて、不幸なわけがありません。I spoke of a serious expression, quietly, but firmly all the same. It was my approval of his feelings and my gratitude as Satoko's Nini. You're not a Nini. But, Satoko ちゃんには内緒にしてくださいね。彼女、私が養子にしたいなんて知ったら、こんなスケベ男なんか、誰がパパと呼ぶものですかって、不愛そうですから。<笑> I wonder. Satoko may have been somewhat childish, but she was still able to empathize with people. She'd call him that. I knew it. As if my feelings had gotten across, Coach grinned, satisfied, and returned his gaze to the hustle and bustle before us. Oh no, who ate all the wagyu? Her parents and her older brother. She lost her family, had no relatives, and was huddled up with Rika chan, who was in the same situation. Satoko Hojo. It wouldn't be odd for her to look at her life with despair, but she didn't seem to feel that way. And she lived energetically with a smile. I know when you are a t s my demo, what I take the h o s h i n e s It was a naive wish, and yet it was one that he couldn't help hoping for. So the words that I spoke were the same. Kigu desne, or a more monazgo to congratimas. Oh, yeah, my baracum modesca. There are what I stat you are, Nakama desne. Okay, coach, y a k s u k s h i m a s h I don't like where this is going. It's a very simple one, the coach said, giving me a grin. Zettai ni. Kanojo o nakase tari shi nai. I don't know, she cries easily. I can't make that promise. It was short and to the point. Ah, hi. Why are we promising? Coach nodded happily. We exchanged no more words after that.、Uh, coach, I gotta go、uh, help my dad butter the dog.、Uh, we just sat there comfortably gazing at Satoko and everyone else having a good time. This is weird. <laughs> Creepy, even. She'd certainly lost a family member, but there were people watching over her. How reassuring must that have been? Carini, this you? Satoko, Yoshi, Dictara. Doshmas? Hmm. So, the one was a she summoned this me. Coach gave a wry, happy smile, and then exaggeratedly tilted his head in contemplation. I swear if you say so. Mazu, this me. What does no koto, Goshujin, Sama to Yobasete? そうそう。She is back. Look who's back, back again. Crazy girl is back again. Satoko, the Bun Senzok no Puritchi na made on his route, Hakiri Mashta. Oh, hi, Shion. It's、ah, not nice to see you again. Sorewa e this ne. Great, it's like two of my least favorite people. Satoko, <laughs> together in one place. Puritchi. You are weird. Ah, Puritti to Puritchi wa Niterio de Bimioni Chingai Mascarane. Nihono Wabisabi o Mixta. ワイオ接中の言葉なので注意してくださいなるほどないや日本語は本当奥が深いよな I mean, this is true. English is a weird language. そうそうケイちゃんはよく理解してますではそういうことで for...、oh, My hand shot out and grabbed Shion, smiling, waving, and about to leave by the nape of her neck おい待てこら突然現れて何をとんでもないことを言ってやがるんだとんでもないことって言ったら
ケイちゃんと監督がしてたサトコラブのトークの話を聞いてくれてありがとうございます。幼稚園組のあたりから再現してご覧に入れます。再現してご覧に入れます。お前、そんな時から息を潜めてやがって。お前、I forgot about Chion and her two fingers and a thumb. お姉にすらかなわないケイちゃんが私に歯向かおうなんて100年早いってことです。<laughs> This was she on Sonazagi. The younger of the Sonazagi twins. Why do they always say it's the younger of the twins? They're freaking twins. They're the same age. Though she hadn't a scrap of the reserved quality you'd expect from a little sister. She was a villain no better than her older sister, Mion. Um, yeah, I'm, because I'm getting, I'm like 99% sure that she owned was actually the one at the end of chapter 2 who did all the murdering and torturing and stuff. We met the other day in town and I dug myself into a hole when I mistook her for Mion. Unlike m i o n s h i o n said that she was living in Okinomiya. Okido... Okinomiya. So I thought she, we'd never see each other again. But to think we actually would. And my frankly displeased expression didn't change a bit either. This must be what people mean when they say something is like water off a duck's back. s h i o n san, you can get a good idea. Get a good idea. How did she get an invite to the all-you-can-eat bar? How did she get an invite to the all-you-can-eat bar? How did she get an invite to the all-you-can-eat bar? How did she get an invite to the all-you-can-eat bar? How did she get an invite to the all-you-can-eat bar? How did she get an i n 実は私がひなみざわファイターズのマネージャーだからなんです。Oh man, I'm staying away from this team. マネージャー。With her as the manager and him as the coach, uh-uh, I don't want anything to do with this team again. 嘘だろ。そんなら、なんで昨日の試合にいなかったんだよ。She was actually the one in the full body cast, not me. マネージャーはマネージャーでも、幽霊マネージャーですから。でへ。She seemed to think I'd forgive her if she stuck her tongue out and smiled. I don't. She wasn't sorry at all. シオンちゃんが来てくれないと。試合に花がないんです。Okay, keep it in your pants, dude. 練習までとは言いませんから、試合にくらい、また昔みたいに応援に来てくれませんかね。Shion, we can replace you in a second with an identical copy, literally. うーん、まあ、考えておきます。ケイちゃんがひなみざわファイターズに移籍するんなら考えてもいいかな。Don't do that! 私、かっこいい男の子がいないと、応援する張り合いがないんです。Did, did Shion just smoothly say something absurd? Yes. <laughs> Suddenly, Mion came running over, latched onto my shoulders, and pulled me towards her. It's just her sister. レナの名前を覚えててくれてありがとう<笑> Thanks for remembering me そんな挨拶はどうでもいいのケイちゃんの勧誘なんてダメだからね<笑> Mion remembers what happened in chapter 2 She's like, we're not doing that again ケイちゃんは我が部のホープなんだから野球なんかに引っこ抜かないで Mion gave a low growl as she grappled my arm She looked like a little girl desperately clinging to her toy <笑>ケイチ君はうちの部活の期待の新人なの。I prefer star player。だからトレードとかは全然ダメなんだよ。You could trade me away for pro Bowser。Rena smile hit a nonchalant blood thirst。She was blocking Chion's way ready to unleash the ultimate attack if she got within two meters of me。Ah, I felt like this was gonna turn into a bloody battle。うーん。<笑>それは残念です。じゃあ交渉はまたの機会にあんたに交渉権なんかないの<笑>監督なんでシオンまで呼んだわけいや、わいシオンは丸一年もサボってる遊泳部員じゃない I mean, You know, to be fair, m i o n she does have a job It's not a great one, but she does have a job Oh wait, m i o n works as well, never mind <笑>シオンちゃんがいると賑やかになって楽しいかなって思ったんですけどねうんうん実に、にぎやかになりました。That was what he planned for all along. Mission accomplished. ほらケイちゃん、おいでおいでみんなでゲームやるよもちろん、罰ゲーム付きでね。Great! 
なんでそうね。私も一緒に参加して姉妹対決にした方がいいですか多分、やめといた方がお姉のためだと思いますけど。あ、あ、がんぴー。What it seemed like the twins were completely incompatible with each other. Yeah, she definitely remembers what happened in Chapter 2. An angry Mio dragged me away. Slide. Shion waved her hand at us, revealing in the bliss of te uh, reveling in the bliss of teasing Mion. All right, <laughs> all right. Club activities had begun, which meant I needed to clear my mind. What was today's battle? Today's punishment game? I take anything on. Hora, hora, Gatesa. Kaku go nasai masu yo. Kyou wa tete teki ni ikimasu wa yo. Oh, joto da ze. Sato ko daro to dar daro to. Hey, so, uh, who can eat the most barbecue? Because you will lose. She's prepubescent, that's why. Oh, do we not even get to see the game? Oh, okay. Unless it's just cutting to the game right after dish. Nope, we skipped the game. <laughs> Everyone who lost the game dropped out and had to help us clean up after the barbecue. Shion, are, are you laughing at me, Yon? Shion laughed more uproariously than anyone I'd ever heard when she saw my loser face. Okay, okay. Was my getting bombed out of the game really that funny? Where's it just rock, paper, scissors? I was, it was going great until we had maintained a unified front. But Satogo had been quicker to betray me than I her. She was just a tiny bit better than me. Ugh! Build an army, trust nobody. Tomita-kun and Okamura-kun were unanimously wearing I told you so faces. Incidentally, those two were victims of Satoko's traps pretty early on as well. And once again, for the showdown, it didn't matter. Maybe this meant I still couldn't match up to the other members yet. Shion remarked, as though forcing me to recall something I'd tried to forget, even for a moment. Whoever loses has to have a conversation with Coach. It's worse than the death. Angel Moto's safe coat, Chota's stick, Red, Tanamaretan, Desk, Do. So, it's not a 
できる限り大きめのサイズでって言われたんですけど。So, I mean, Kuhn and Okamura Kuhn were giving me these complex, indescribable looks, mixing empathy, pity, and the desire to see something scary all at once. <laughs> all I could do now was <laughs> just laugh. <laughs> Strangely enough, the more I laughed, the more it felt like I was actually funny. Ah! I lost! Are, are? Maebara san, do you see what I'm saying? I held my hands, head in the hands of agony. Ah, my state of mind could be summed up with a three letter word. It was. <laughs> Coach gently put his hands on my shoulders. Was he comforting me? My bara san, Kukyo, Ukele, Nakereba, Narana, Tokiwa, this name. Kibishi, Shido, Ukete, Ru, Maid. Will you shut up about slutty maids? Ora, Zetsbo, the Kina situation. Red in the face and indulging in his imagination, still holding my shoulders, Coach said, Nope, not, re not reading that. This guy's freaking weird AF. He's a 9.9. .9. I had to wonder what kind of word associations he had going on in his head. I don't want to know. At the very least, he was, it was much different than what was in mine. The first thing that comes into mind when I think of disciplining certainly isn't maids. Tomita kun, Okamura kun. Yeah, I feel like this guy just always thinks of maids just all the time. It, it, it's years, years of indulging that particular behavior. Kimi tachi no kantoku wa jitsu ni omoshiroi na. Kon na no de, yoku kantoku ga tsutomaru na. No and yes. Tomita kun and Okamura kun exchanged glances and answered with dry smiles. Then they added that he was a really nice person most of the time, which is something you'd normally say about a person like that. <laughs> he has a great personality, except he doesn't. The coach's questionable revolutions slowed to a stop, and then his expression returned to a clear, calm one, almost making what just happened seem like an illusion. He can switch gears way too fast. <laughs> He's used to constantly looking over his shoulders for the cops showing up. Maebara-san is a good person, right? I hoisted the dirty barbecue plates, each with slimy oil clated to it, and looked for the wash basins. Ah, oh, these! These are heavy! Where's the wash basins? Over there? Figuring I should make it there before my arms gave out, I headed towards it at a trot. A lot of the adults who had been helping out were using the wash basins, so I gave up and looked for a different set. I asked them, and they told me that there were more by the assembly hall, too, so I headed that way. Rather than multiple basins, there was just one faucet there. I initially thought it would be too small to wash plates as big as these, but it would probably still be faster than waiting for a faucet to open up back there. I turned the faucet on and water, much nicer looking than it gushed forth. I put a plate under the faucet and scrubbed it with my hand to try to rub it clean. It didn't go very well. Hey, sponge and cleanser. I think, Shion. Oh, this <laughs> Keiichi never had to do the dishes growing up. It was Shion. She threw a brand new sponge in a container full of cleaner to me. Oh, thank you. I got the feeling that wasn't quite a compliment. I answered her with a forced smile. Shion was the manager of Hinamizawa Fighters. I thought it was a bit of a problem. I thought it was a bit of a problem. え、めんどくさいですよ。ですから今は完全に幽霊ですけどね。監督、帰ってきてほしいって言ってたじゃないか。いや、but <笑> Shion neither offered to help nor got in my way. She just quietly watched the water flowing from the faucet. 
ケイちゃんが大活躍したそうじゃないですか。Yes, and. おめるなら、俺よりもホームランを決めたサトコの方だろう。あいつ、運動神経良かったんだな。俺驚いたよ。サトシ君とは大違いです。きっと、運動神経は妹に全部取られちゃったに違いないですね。シオン smiled as she spoke. Her eyes looking at something far away, betraying her reminiscence. サトシ君北条サトコの兄です。北条サトシ君あそっかケイちゃんって今年引っ越してきたんでしたっけなら会ったことはありませんね会ったことはないけど少しは知ってるよ確か両親が亡くなった後転校したんだよな I avoided saying that he ran away from home and used the slightly more vague words that everyone else did 転校誰がそんなこと言ったんですか<笑> ?No, I killed him. へへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへへ Alright, here's where the creepy stuff starts happening. <laughs> She's like, no, he didn't transfer. I killed him, and we're alone now. Oh, she. <laughs> 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 ありますよ。転校届が出されたわけですか学校とかに。それを誰かが見たそれとも聞いたシオン、I don't like this. Around that time, I not only noticed how awfully caught up on the Shion was, but how startlingly dangerous her eyes had begun to look. シオン、なんだよお前。目がマジだぞ。With that, Shion seemed to realize the expression she was making. She took a deep breath, pretending to fix her hair, and went back to her composed expression from before. <laughs> What?、Uh, no, I, I, I didn't mean anything about it. What? You're crazy! I've always looked like this. I realized I must have said something I shouldn't have. But I wasn't immediately sure of what I should apologize for, so I just said the one safe word for now. Sorry. I was like, I'm going to be a little bit of 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 a little ちょっと言葉がきつすぎましたね。あいまります。ちょっと言葉がきつすぎましたね。あいまります。別に気にしてないよ。That was a fib. I was actually a little scared even. Was there something wrong with saying he ran away? Was there some sort of misunderstanding in saying that he transferred? But before I could ask her, she turned on her heel to leave. おい、しよう。じゃ、頑張ってください。けいちゃんのプレートで最後みたいですよ。Her final remark reminded me of the dishes I had so easily forgotten about. So immersed in conversation, where we. Where were we? What? So immersed in conversation, were we, that it got pretty late. Okay. I'm pretty sure they missed a comma there. I turned the faucet again to get the water flowing faster. I violently scrubbed the plate. When I turned back around, Shion was no longer there. Or was she? By the time I'd finished washing the plates, most of the other things had been cleaned up. The air had cooled off before I'd realized it, and as the heat that had stuck with us all day dispersed, a nice breeze started to blow. Was that our first taste of the horror to come? Could be!